Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you stopped by and I hope you're enjoying your day. As you may have noticed, I took a little break, but now I'm back. In today's video, I'm gonna share some new home decor. So I'm gonna share my take on some very beautiful, neutral and abstract wall art. I know you guys have seen this wall art everywhere. It's all the rage. I've seen it online, I've seen it in magazines, I've seen it on Etsy, and they range anywhere from $150 and up, depending upon the size. One of the things that I like about it, not only do I like the 3D type texture, is that it's versatile. It can go with no matter what your decor theme is, whether you're transitional, contemporary, or modern, or minimal. It's super easy and it's aesthetically pleasing. So I'm gonna give this a try and I made one and I liked it so much, I made a second one. I already have the materials that I need left over from another project, but you'll need some spackle, a putty knife, some gesso, if you're reusing a canvas, paintbrush, and gloves. So I got a piece of cardboard that was the dimensions that I needed for the frame that I already have and I added spackle to it. I put my gloves on because as I said earlier I like to get in there with my fingers and spread it out. You can also use paint if you want to customize your abstract art um, to flow with the color theme in your home. So here I'm just covering the board with spackle and now I'm going to take the comb and drag it through the spackling to give myself a decorative design on the front of the canvas. And once I finished drawing the lines, I also went back and textured the other parts to give it that more 3D effect. And then after that I let it dry. I purchased some plexiglass for the front and the back of the frame that I had gotten from Ikea. I used command strips so I sandwiched it in between plexiglass and put it inside the frame that I already had that I had gotten from Ikea. And I hung it on the wall. I love the way it turned out. I think that is so pretty. And then I had some stems that I had gotten from Hobby Lobby. I'm not sure what, they're not olive. I'm not sure what type of stems they are, but they were absolutely beautiful. And the vase I got from Home Goods. Of course, there's my signature candle, Cashmere Plum. The basket I got from Home Goods. And now for the second canvas. Here you're gonna see me using gesso. I decided to use gesso on this one because again, it was already, it was a lot of color. So there was a lot of pigment on this. There was a lot of pigment on this canvas already and a lot of texture. So I thought that I would take it back to a white base by using the gesso and I'm glad that I did. It really makes a difference. So I'm gonna do two coats of gesso. I'm gonna let it dry a couple hours in between and then I'll come back and actually add the speckle. Now here I'm taking the putty knife and I'm adding the spackle to the canvas that's been gessoed and has dried. And um, 
I'm gonna use the putty knife and I'm gonna use my fingers to get it on there. My canvas was not big, but it is very long, so it was starting to dry on me, so I was trying to work really fast to get my highs and my lows and texturize it just the way that I wanted before it dried too much. But it was drying quick because I was outside. I ain't worried about the future cause I know it's in your hands I'm the furthest thing from perfect but I know you understand I was limping quick to running now I'm flying Peter Pan And it's all because of every single step I had your hand, yeah Every single step I had your hand Now I got the blessings on demand Anything you say is my command Whole life heard no, but you told me that I can't So I lay it all out cause I trust you like that And I give it all to you cause you got it like that Any seed that I sow, boom, a rain right back Now I'm living with a drug, you can never buy that Yeah, yeah, it ain't never easy Life can be hard But if you trust and you believe it You can make it with God, God, yeah So I let it dry overnight. Luckily, this canvas already had um, the hanging mechanisms on the back, so all I had to do was put it on the wall, and I love the way it turned out. I can't think of anything I did or even do to deserve just one inch of your love that makes people new. And the way that you saved me out of that den when all of the lions were covering my head, you had another plan. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed my new home decor. If you did, hit that subscribe button, leave me a comment, and hit that like button. And make sure you come back and tune in. See you next time. Bye. Never do it. We said we wanna see change, but